Hi, this is Tutor Nick P, and this is Interjections 160. The interjection today is ta-ta. Okay, if somebody wants a screenshot, do it right now. Let's get right to it. Ta-ta basically means goodbye. Uh, it is sometimes abbreviated as TTFN, meaning ta-ta for now or goodbye for now. Uh, it is mostly used in British English, uh, as well as sometimes used or maybe sometimes heard in Australia, New Zealand, and South Africa as well. But let's continue. Most Americans recognize this term for movies, but it is rarely used in American English. Americans may sometimes use it in a humorous way to copy British speakers. So if they were trying to put on a British accent or something, they may add a ta-ta, you know, they may, they may do that. So... They do recognize it, but they don't really use it. Let's continue. Uh, sometimes one could also see it spelled as, well, I'll just read it all as ta-ta, 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 etc. with, you know, three different spellings. And there might even be a couple of more spellings. You may see it, but uh, the term has been used since the 1820s. So it's been around a long time. It is believed it may have come about from infant or baby speech. So, I think they said maybe babies trying to learn how to say thank you or something. Ta, 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 well, whatever. <laughs> anyway, that's where some of them believe it may have come from. It was also greatly popularized in 1941 by a BBC radio program called It's That Man Again. Okay, let's continue. Um, in which a cleaning lady, woman character, Miss Mop, uh, often spoke it when departing, when she was going. It was also popularized even more by its common use during World War II. Maybe that show, you know, because that was 1941, that was actually during World War II, and this became really popular at that time in Britain. You know, it was used that much more. Let's continue. And we got five examples to show just how it's used. Here's the first one. In the old TV show Bewitched, you know, which was an American TV show, uh, the character Endora often used to say TTFN before disappearing in thin air. Yeah, so uh, it's strange, though. Bewitch was supposed to be American, but, you know, some of her relatives had a British accent. Uh, anyway, that's, that, that was used in, in the American TV show. We used to use, hear that. Uh, all right, number two, ta-ta, I hope you come back soon. Okay, so this is just typical other ways that you may hear somebody say goodbye. Ta-ta, have a good trip. Yeah, maybe. Uh, I have to go now, ta-ta, you know, you might hear it that way, or ta-ta, see you later. Okay, anyway, I hope you got it, I hope it was clear, I hope it was very informative. Thank you for your time, bye-bye.